The man accused of inappropriately touching kids at a Disney water park is out of jail this noon after posting bond this morning. Yeah, that man is accused of groping six different people at Typhoon Lagoon Water Park. New 6 reporter Mark Lehman tells us how the suspect wanted nothing to do with us and even ran back into jail. Roughly eight hours after posting bond, the accused groper finally left the Orange County Jail here. And again, we were here working to get answers about what happened at the Disney water park. Anything to say to those children? No comments. What was the misunderstanding? No comments. Rushing into the passenger seat of an Uber car, Aman Bathia dodged our camera for a second time today. A move echoed from when the 27-year-old first posted bail overnight. You don't have a comment? Did you no. touch those girls? Sorry, I, 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 no comment. The Indian National is facing several charges after deputies say he targeted young teens in the wave pool at Typhoon Lagoon. At least six people reported being grabbed, the first telling an adult after claiming to be touched all over. That's when witnesses say they watched it happen again and again. According to one young victim's account, as soon as the wave hit, the defendant grabbed the teen from behind. Deputies say another was pinched in a private area, leaving a red mark. Eventually, Bathia was placed under arrest after being confronted by witnesses and a lifeguard. That's when he claimed the touching was unintentional. In a report, the deputy wrote, Mr. Bathia denied following anyone. He stated his vision was fuzzy since he did not have his glasses on. At this point, it's not known where Batia will be staying while he's out on bond. His last known address is listed in Baton Rouge, Louisiana. The next court date for his case has not yet been scheduled. In Orange County, Mark Lehman, News 6.